Hi folks, Adam here. Just out in the shop today with Sierra. Hmm. So today we're going to show you how to change a fuel filter on a 2018 GMC Sierra diesel. It's in the background. But, of course, before we get started, time to get a little diesel fuel on the hands. Not today. When you're changing a fuel filter, you must use rum. Because this is a big job for the average guy. <laughs> Not really. But, Sierra made me a cup. Thank you very much. Good job. All you need to do this job is the fuel filter, a half inch drive ratchet, and a 1 and 7 16 socket or a wrench, a drain pan, some kind of high pollutant light, <laughs> not really, and gloves. Now you're gonna be like, oh, look at that guy. I gotta put on rubber gloves to change a fuel filter. Yeah, you know why? I'm married and I do not need to say anymore. Plus I work in my shop and I might wanna make another drink. So now we're gonna go over and we're gonna take the old fuel filter off. And as you can see, underneath the wheel is the block I made in the last video. And I did that to give a little more room under the truck. We'll say it's for the camera. I'll say it's for the belly. So underneath the truck, I'm gonna get Sierra to pass me the phone and I will show you something. When you crawl under the truck, right here is the fuel filter. So you're gonna unscrew this, and this canister will drop down, some fuel's gonna come out, and then you can take it to the bench and put your new filter in. So I'll give the phone back to Sierra, and when I take it off, she can show you what it looks like. Now you see why I put on rubber gloves. Okay, take this over to the bench. So there's the old fuel filter. Wiggle it around, comes right out of the canister. There's an O-ring on this canister. You need to take that off. And then what I like to do, I'll just grab a rag. I always take a can of brake cleaner. Just to clean off the excess fuel off the canister, get it clean again. So apparently, 
the socket I used will fit this, but also, I see I, the last time I've done this, I wrote on it, 36 millimeter is the metric size, but the inch and 7 16 fits it too. Okay, so we're done with this. We'll set that over here for starting the fire tomorrow. Let's pop off these rubber gloves now. And we'll get out the new filter. The only reason why I changed my fuel filter myself is because they want a fortune to do this at the dealership. Not sure why. I get my oil changed there. And it is cheaper for the dealership to change my oil than it is for me to change it. Otherwise, I enjoy getting my hands full of oil too. Okay, so put the new O-ring on. What I like to do with that is I always have a little bit of something in the shop. In this case, I have a little bit of Vaseline. Put that on there. That just makes it so that the O-ring doesn't get caught when you put this cap back on. Put it in the right way. And you just push that in and it locks in place. There it is, it's in there, won't come out. Now you'll see in your baggie, there is another little rubber O-ring. Before you screw this on, there's a little thing that goes in here and you need to put this O-ring on it. So I don't need to show you that, you'll see that when you're underneath there. Let me just take this back. There's the old one. And you don't really have to put lube on this O-ring because there's still a little bit of fuel right there. Take the fuel filter. Snug it up. There it is. Apparently I'm tripping over scooters. Who's a they? And now, on the dash of your truck, I'll show you inside here. When you turn your key on, I've already reset mine. You can hear your fuel pump running. That's filling up that filter. So when you go in your settings, you find your fuel filter life right there and you just hold the check mark button. It beeps at you, it says 100% now. And I always like to shut my key off and turn it back on just to make sure that the filter has filled, which it has. So now you can start your truck. And there you go. It's good to go. We will shut it off. Basically, no time at all. Fuel filters change. Save yourself some money. I'm Adam. This is Sierra. Thanks for watching and have a great day.